I think a lot of Beretta owners will probably remark on this as this gun's come in. The front and back screws inside here are already loose. I'm literally, they were think I didn't even have to put any pressure to remove them. They, as the gun, as you shoot the gun, uh, they do have a tendency to come loose. Uh, and also with the heat. So I'm just gonna take these screws out. Beretta screws in the fore end here, the little, the little screws that run through. Uh, that's two different lengths. The long one goes to the front and the short one goes to the back. Um, if for, for whatever reason, if you find one come loose and you, uh, you, you, know, want, you want to tighten them up or take one out, um, just remember that. Otherwise, if you put, put them the other way around, you'll find the screw overhanging out and you could cut your hand at the bottom. So in a Beretta 4 and there actually isn't a huge amount here to, to check. This is two little plungers and coil springs just in here. Um, to be honest, on this particular gun, we'll just probably wash this through, to be quite frank, because there's not much muck in there. Um, we will just take the, the, the catch out. There's a bit of muck and there's a little bit of rust in there. We'll just try and clean that out. I'll just I'll clean this rust off just around the edge here as well. Uh, we're just trying to find something that sort of breaks things down, uh, breaks oil down, and washes things out. It doesn't. It's not going to cause rust because some solutions can. Uh, some cleaning products can, call, uh, can, can be, uh, cause corrosion afterwards to a certain degree, and paraffin's fairly safe. There's a little bit of rust on the underside here, just where the guy's finger goes, picks up the catch. I'm just going to give us a little cheeky polish. Just spend that little extra time on it, just make sure it looks really, really smart. I'm not trying to polish the engraving, I'm just, just trying to polish around the edge of it a little bit, just where there's a few scuffs, just so it all looks uniform and crisp. And then we'll, we'll put that back together.